Good morning. Today is September 2nd. It's a Thursday. Thanks for checking in, checking up on me. Uh, it is 5.17 in the morning. Still doing my rounds. Still doing my May morning jogs. And as you can see, I'm breathing through my mouth right now. And that's primarily because I've been jogging over here but i've done my whole run today just absolutely consciously did my whole run while breathing through my nose only and that was my my goal and you know what i feel good i feel good maybe it's myself being biased to some learning something new but uh, even last night and for those of you wondering this is a continuation of yesterday's video i started reading the book uh breathing the new science behind the lost art of breathing and he just basically compares breathing through your nose or called nose breathing versus breathing through your mouth or mouth breathing and how there's a lot of different supposed uh and he goes into the science and the research behind it of the benefits of breathing through your nose and people say isn't breathing just breathing did you know according to science both nostrils when you breathe in through them your right nostril has a different function and the air coming to the left nostril has a different function oh did you know that that was something very very new for me yesterday and he goes on to explain that the right nostril is kind of like the gas the gas uh, pedal in your car and the right nostril get your blood flowing you get your heart pumping get your dige digestion uh, moving get your heart rate up and if you go through the left side your left nostril that's kind of like the brake so if you bre breathe only through your left nostril then it, it has more of a calming effect it lowers anxiety lowers stress I know it sounds really, really, you know, hocus pocus, <laughs> um, but this is what I'm just quoting what it says in the in the book. And so the, the author, oh, I can't figure his name right now. Shucks, I said it yesterday. Anyway, it's on it's on the thumbnail yesterday's video. The author, like, said he he just tried. You know, if you just plug plug one side up and breathe through the left side then you actually feel a bit different than if you plug this side up and breathe only through the right side um but anyway he says that's kind of just antidental antidotal antidotal Ant antidotal he says just basically i mean nobody can go go through their life with just holding their nostril this nostril open the other nostril open but he just said there's a lot of benefits that come from breathing through your nose so anyway, long story short, not gonna give you a full summary of the book. If you, if you want it, you can check it out. The thumbnails on yesterday's uh, book, uh, yesterday's YouTube video. Um, and so what I tried is, and he mentions it in the book, mentions about sleep tape, or basically taping your mouth shut. Get some scotch tape, just put a, put a small little thin strip, maybe kind of hooks under here so that uh, there's a little bit more resistance because it's just this this tall that it's easily to just fall right off anyway tape your mouth shut and practice breathing through your nose so i did that for an hour yesterday while sitting in front of the computer and i did that last night before i went to sleep so i slept last night with a piece of tape on my mouth and when i before i went to sleep my nasal cavities felt very closed felt uh like there was a lot of resistance of breathing in air and but when i woke up in the morning i didn't die by the way i didn't i didn't choke to death <laughs> but when i woke up this morning i noticed that my nasal cavities were very very open and clear um and it's just a classic example of you know use it and if you don't use it you lose it and he goes on to talk about how 
yeah, like any muscle in your body, if we don't practice using uh, breathing through our noses, <clears throat> then our nasal cavities will shrink and, you know, uh, you have just congestion problems. And But if you force yourself to kind of just push through that pain, that initial pain of, man, this sucks, I can't breathe by breathing through my nose only, then supposedly there's a lot of really good benefits. So I'm... I'm a living example. I'm a living uh, test test experiment of his, and I put myself through this happily, because to me the effects of it is very very instant, and I can see results immediately. <laughs> so I'm gonna keep going. I'm gonna keep keep this experiment up. I'm gonna keep going farther into the book. I think I'm on chapter. I think I finished chapter two yesterday. Uh, I just finished chapter four. I chapter two the two days ago. I finished chapter four yesterday. So I'm gonna just keep going on this book. Love it. If you if you're into like holistic, like healing and holistic ways of just kind of taking care of yourself and taking care of your body, uh, this is highly recommended. So you just kind of just get your insights from this book. Um, yeah, it's good stuff. So anyway, feeling good, feeling healthier. Um, yeah. And my, my biggest, my biggest uh, way that I can compare is my runs in the morning. Because there's a, there's a few days, a few weeks ago, it's just it was absolutely brutal. Yeah, maybe, maybe it's my body just kind of fighting against me, like it's upset at getting up so early in the morning. But that's alright. I, I found that even on my sprints, I just, this morning, I just tried to breathe through my nose, breathe through my nose, keep my mouth shut, keep my mouth closed. And breathing through my nose and it was tough it is hard when you're like huffing and puffing without breathing through your mouth that's hard but supposedly the oxygen concentration that it can get to your blood cells and uh, your oxygen saturation increases by like 13 or 16 percent uh, when you breathe in through your nose so i'm 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 more yay than nay for this whole experiment because like I said, I can see some good results, but try it and uh, check it out. Do some research. Don't take my word for it. And uh, yeah, we'll, we'll catch you in the next one. But uh, yeah, James Nestor, I think that's his name, James Nestor. Uh, breath, the new science behind the lost art of breathing. Check it out. All right, Jesse, you're amazing. You're good, you're great. Keep it up every day. You're down here, you're doing your thing. And uh, We'll see you next time. Aloha. Love you.